We're visiting the south of Israel today in communities along the Gazan border. There's been a big challenge on the border, as you can see from the destruction around me, as incendiary balloons have been released from Gaza and they're causing the fields on the Israeli side to go up in flames, causing a lot of destruction. We're here to express our solidarity, to provide essential firefighting equipment, and to speak to the people so we can understand more about what their lives are like. My name is Ilan Isaacson. I'm the head of security of the Eshkol region. I have 32 officers that work for me that live on the 32 kibbutzim and mushavim. And each one, if they had a, a fire fighter, they usually will be the first ones to come to every fire. First of all, it's in their vicinity. So it's very important that each kibbutz and each mushav has trailers. We had about uh, 22, 23 trailers. And now, uh, after the help of you guys, we have another five trailers, which is uh, very efficient. My name is Daniel Bourd. I am uh, working here uh, 30 years as I, I am in charge of all the avocado orchard. We are crossing really bad times now. We have here close to 60 trees that, that, that were burned. To gain again this, we have to wait at least five, six years to uh, be in the same place that we were before the fire. My name is Sagida Kalchen, uh, and four years ago I was the founder, one of the founders, to open this, this uh, music school. And now we have 42 kids. Being here is something very brave. Maybe they don't necessarily understand how brave it is to be four kilometers from the Gaza border, but their parents do. These, these bomb shelters are the only reason we can have this boarding school here. We can't be here without them. So this region is in need of two things in particular. Shelters, okay, because rockets are being fired at this region every single week. And you need shelters and we need more shelters. We've been getting um, firefighter trailers and we need more for this area. They can get to uh, the source of the fire very, very quickly, quicker than anything else, and extinguish the flames so that the, uh, the danger passes. Those are the two main things that are needed in this area. They still need our help, and they deeply appreciate our solidarity. Join with us today to help them meet this new challenge.